Hi guys, so um, just wanted to give you guys an update for week, what week am I doing? Week 8. Um, so currently I am 9 weeks and 2 days. Um, so just want to go over what happened in week 8. Um, so first thing that happened on week 8 um, on... I think I was like eight weeks in one day. It was in the very beginning. Um, we're having our house remodeled, as you guys know by now. <laughs> um, and my husband and I thought that, you know, it would be a good idea to maybe camp in our backyard while the remodel's going on, um, just so we don't have to wake up, mm, excuse me, to loud banging at six in the morning. So we set up the tent, had a campsite, all that stuff, and um, I was putting my pajamas on, and I was in the tent, getting ready to go to bed, and all of a sudden I had to puke. So I just like opened the tent door and was puking outside the tent. It was disgusting. Horrible. Um, and I know it was because I just took my prenatals not too long ago, and... Um, even, I mean, I try to take my prenatals on a full stomach. I normally try to take them in the evening right before I go to bed. And lately, I have not been able to keep down my prenatals. This is even going into week nine. So, which, you know, is kind of sad. I really want to take my prenatals. Um, so I ordered some gummy vitamins just, you know, and during this first trimester, if that's how I... Um, get my vitamins is through the gummies and that's what I'm going to do and then once I can stomach my other vitamins I'll go back to taking them. So started off eight weeks by puking. Um, I puked at the end of eight weeks as well and every time I've thrown up it's been at night time. It hasn't been in the morning so yeah. Um, what else? Um, Oh, during week eight, I also had my first proper midwife appointment, um, and that was really amazing. Uh, I got to meet both of the midwives, actually. The midwife that I've um, selected who will be delivering the baby, she's actually also a naturopathic doctor, and um, she's also a registered nurse. So I, I just really liked her qualifications and her personality really clicked with mine, so... Um, yeah, I'm really excited to use her. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much the, the most part. What's gone on in, in week eight, you know, I, week eight is the first week that I started throwing up. And it seems to be induced by primarily by my vitamins, although I did throw up yesterday night and I hadn't taken vitamins. I just ate some cereal and apparently the baby didn't like it. Um, something exciting that I guess is relevant to week nine, but whatever, I'm just gonna tell you guys anyway. Um, the baby is already sucking its thumb. Oh, that just, that's crazy. It's already sucking its thumb. And at nine weeks, 75% of babies show, or fetuses, I guess, um, show right hand dominance in the womb already. That's just insane to me. Um, oh, <laughs> another symptom is I am always burping, which is really annoying. I've never been one to burp before pregnancy, and so now it's like I'm always burping all the time, and my husband thinks it's so funny. He's like laughing at me all day long because he knows I never burp, and so I can't control it. So I guess it's probably because I'm, I must be gassy. I feel very bloated and burping all day long, but... Whatever, I'll take it. Um, oh, see, had to burp right there. <clears throat> yeah, <laughs> it's really annoying when you're at work and you don't want to burp when you're on the phone with a um, a client. Is so that's always interesting. Um, <laughs> so anyway, that's what's going on here. As far as the best thing about week eight is, I got to hear the baby's heartbeat at my um, midwife appointment and I did not know that they were gonna let me hear the heartbeat they were like oh you know we'll just we'll just bust out the Doppler and 
you know, we'll see. They're like, don't get upset if you don't hear the heartbeat. If you're really early still, and a lot of women don't hear it till they're farther along. I was like, okay, that's fine. I don't care. Just let's try it anyway. And as soon as they put the Doppler down by my uterus, I heard it right away. Um, so I definitely started tearing up and oh, I'm going to start crying right now. Ah, <sighs> it was the most amazing sound in the world. So that is by far the best thing about week eight. So, all right guys, well, I will talk to you very soon and I hope every single one of you are doing well. All right, bye.